Hello and welcome back. It's me, Grumpy Tuck, and this is Nine Lives. And I've had a brainwave. As you know, I enjoy discovering stuff. But the great Robin Hood out there used to discover things from the rich and give them to the poor. So I've decided to look at this. This is magnificent. I've decided to follow suit. So I've shouted on Post Jerry. And I've chucked him some stuff to help him build. Watch out for a skelly. I'm going to get him. Nope, missed. Get him. Oh, that was him. I'm going to get this one. Nope, missed that one. I am a terrible shot. So yeah, Post Jerry and Sonic have teamed up and they are Team Hokey Pokey, hence the HP. So I've decided to give them some of the stuff I've found along the way to help them with their build. So that's some red blocks there. And what else can I give them? I mean, I have discovered quite a few things in the last few days, weeks. So uh, let's let's um, start off with some glow berries. You can have them, and some sweet berries. You can have some drop. Have some of them. Oh, I'm keep forgetting that because I'm free life still. I'm still red, so people are a bit wary of me. I'll move out of the way, and Jerry can pick up what he's got. That's safe, Jerry. I'm not gonna get you, mate. Okay? These are gifts. I'm, 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 I'm being nice. I'm doing gifts. Okay. Well, he's got the uh, sweet berries. I'll chuck my cactus. Have a, have a cactus. So anyhow, gave Jerry a few things, and then we went outside to look at his build. And what an amazing build he's built! Look at this tower. I love it. I love the different shades. I love the flags on top. I love the big banner. I'm not too sure on the magic floor in spiders what are going up and down the side of it. But, you know, each to their own. Oh, apparently Jerry don't like him either. So, um, I think I'll help him a bit more. I feel guilty for doing so much discovering. So, uh, let's, uh, I don't want to give him all of them. I'll give him, yeah, that'll do. There you go, Jerry. Jerry, here you go, mate. Have have a couple of emeralds as well. That will help you. Jerry looks impressed and happy. Oh, I think his inventory is a bit full. Oh, buns! I could take them. Yeah, I could take them. This is the other issue. Everybody's inventory is still full, I and mean, nobody has sugar boxes because there's no way of getting to the end. So yeah, nice little bit of Jerry. And I thought, what a good thing to do. We should start visiting more people today. So off I went to find other people. This is looking pretty. Oh, there's somebody overhead. Who's this? Who is it? It's... Oh, it's him. Where's his donkey? Dude, where's your donkey? No? No donkey? What's this? Oh, that's nice. See, he's giving me a gift. This is what we should do. We should just start gifting things to each other. Be a happy place. That's 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 today. Yeah, let's be a happy, kind, supportive, caring, friendly place where every so often we have to kill each other with zombies. Just gonna hide in here quickly. I don't even know where this is. Who's this? Ooh, there's a there's a chest. Ooh, bamboo. Bamboo could be useful. Uh, get rid of that. Take with. I'm not pinching with some member. This is not theft. This is discovering. And I'm sure that I'll use the bamboo in future to uh, build something for the community, like a community service built. That's it. Grumpy Tuck, the community service guy. That's exactly what I'm all about. So keeping in mind the community service, I went to meet Unholy, and she's just joined the Foxes. And I thought, well, there's only one thing to do, 
with a new member. And that is, let them try out a trap, bounce the castle. There we go, she seems to like it. I do love a bouncy castle. Everybody loves a bouncy castle. So I had a little bounce, and then she went off to show me her base. And some of the things she's done. And the entrance looks lovely. I mean, look at this, this is beautiful. So, in we went, look at the artwork. Oh, I like these. I don't know how she's done that, but I like it. And, uh, what's in here? <gasps> look, no, I will not open the chest. Let's go see what she's got. Oh, look, it's one of those, um, like, orby things, what are not called orbs, but I can never remember her names. And we'll just go look at this. More chests. Farm. Oh, good supply of carrots. And a double, double fish farm. That's, that's clever. I don't know how she uses a double fish farm when she's by herself, but you know. And she's got a skelly spawner. Oh, she's doing alright for herself, this unholy. Oh, I'm quite happy for her. This is good, this is, this is positive. The only issue is, I can't be nice for too long. So we decided to pay DJ a visit. Because why not? And we realised that his front door might have been trapped. Oh, I think this is actually his back door. DJ won't mind me smashing his back door. So, um, let's just see what we've got. We've got loads of space in my inventory now, so... Is it trapped? Is it? Is it? What's he got? <gasps> Dispenser, what's in there? Well, if I tell you that, it's no longer trapped. So I've just discovered myself a bucket of lava. Ooh, brewing stuff. I, I've just discovered myself some brewing stuff. Thanks, DJ. I'll, I'll use it for community reasons, I swear. I'm so not going to use this for community reasons. So we decided to have a look at his bees, because his bees are cute. I mean, look at them, they're big and his honey place is superb. And then Hurley had a look. I wonder what else is in there. I mean, there's other stuff. It's bound to be. Uh, I don't want to go down here. Oh, oh, he's got a fish farm too. Everybody has a fish farm. Oh, his bees escaped. Well, we know how to deal with this. The only way we can. No, not gonna, not gonna kill it. Gonna attach it to a rope. There we go. Lead it, fence it, and we should really label it so that we can. So there we go. Let's put a label on this thing. NFB, NFB. D DJ's gonna know exactly who this is, but it's it's fine. It's 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 fine. We better get out of here before he finds us. We thought we'd leave him a tree. DJ loves trees, so we're gonna put him now. One of these down. Born Millet, right outside his place. Oh, that's much. DJ's gonna love that. DJ will absolutely love that. So we uh, continued adventuring with uh, good old Unholy and I. And we stumbled across a donkey. And when you stumble across a donkey, it's clear there's only one thing to do with a donkey. I'll just nip back to DJ's and pinch a lead. There we go. Ooh, what are these? Echo shards. I mean, we're useless, but we're pretty. I'll tell you them. I mean, I'll discover them. Uh, anything else? Nah, that's that's it. So, Unholy named the donkey Dominic. And I attached him to a lead. And we took him for a little walk. Come on, Dominic. Come on. Come on, Dominic, and we're going to put him up there. That's right, unholy. Up there is where we're going to put him. Have you got a fence post? I'm sure she does. Come on, unholy. Fence post. Fence post. Perfect. So we'll tie Dominic here. And then what we'll do 
is we'll push him off. Jump. Go. There we go. Dominic, we dangling donkey. Dominic, we dangling donkey. Oh, you know what? DJ's going to see that and he's going to think that's amazing. Dominic, the dangling donkey. It's just perfect. Absolutely perfect. Yeah. I feel like we've achieved something today. So I set off again. And later on returned to DJ. Because he wanted sand. So I gave him sand. Because that's what I'm doing now. I'm giving people things. And I also may have accidentally, on purpose, given him an hour to the face as well. But that's okay. It's DJ. DJ expects these kind of things. Another stringy thing. Is that a trap? It can't be a trap. Maybe it's a trap. Uh, if it's a trap, it's tough. Hey, DJ. So I found an armor trim. And DJ copied it for me. So I can make myself a nice little bit of armor trim on my chest plate. So that goes there. I've never done this before, this is quite cool. And then I need something to go in the not diamond, I can't put diamond on diamond, emerald. That'll do. Oh yes. So with my new armor trim, and I don't know if this is a trap or not, so I'm just gonna discover that as well. Bye DJ! I headed off. Back towards spawn. And a face came charging towards me. Who are you? It's Turdy! Dirty Turdy! I ain't seen him over. He's on one life! I'm on three! Okay, I'm actually on two, but I'll just... I'll explain that in a minute. Well, look! Turdy turned up! So I decided, because, you know, he's not a bad lad, that since I discovered some of his red concrete powder, it's only fair to show him what I used it on. And I did use it on something really good. So, um, what, have I got anything in here for him? There's something right there. Oh, you can have that. Yeah. That'll make up for it. Dirty. Dirty. There you go. Look, red stuff. You like red stuff. And this is what I did with your red concrete powder. Look, I made a base. It's amazing, isn't it? And it's near spawn, so everyone can use it to come and sleep in the beds and stuff. Yeah, you can use it as well, Turdy. Turdy decided not to use it. Instead, we decided to go back to DJ's and try and find him. But, sadly, DJ wasn't home. And Turdy was a bit scared of traps. But we bravely went in instead. DJ? Is he in the cupboard? He's not in the cupboard. He wasn't there at all. So we took Turty back to the uh, red concrete powdered base. And he decided to start decorating. Which was quite nice of him. Before heading off and bumping into... Who's this? Where's your name tag? Oh, Smith. It's okay. I think Smith's a bit rude because me and Turkey are both red. And he's not. Blow my horn. That'll cheer him up. Yeah, no. Okay, let's not cheer him up. He's run away. Smith! Where are you going? Oh, he's got a horse. Smith. No, he's definitely. definitely running away. He's not happy. So I took Turkey back to the red concrete powdered house and left him there whilst I went off to do a little bouncy bouncy because I do love my bouncy castle and I encourage everybody to just come along and just bounce on it it's great fun see lovely fun I kind of feel we need to meet up with DJ again now and here he is now be very quiet I did wonder what he was doing, but it turned out DJ 
was the boogie. And underneath this little ring of death is another player. So DJ has decided the best way to get his boogie kill is to drop an anvil. Let's see if he does it. Come on DJ. Oh! Hello darkness was squashed by a falling anvil. Perfect! Well done! So great! Woo! Party! DJ looks happy. Now I would like to say this is the first time I've seen DJ kill somebody today. But that would be a lie. Because earlier on, when my camera wasn't rolling, he murdered me for no reason. Okay, that's also a lie. I went into his base, noticed he didn't have a shield, so I shot him. But my shooting's not as good as his shooting, and he retaliated, and I lost a life. So now I'm on two lives. But I mean, I can cope with two. Soon Beardor turned up. So I went off to look at a sheep game. Water sheep down. It's a simple game. Just place down on a section something you want to gamble. So I've got a golden apple down here. And then you press the magic button. DJ press the button. DJ. DJ press the button. DJ. Yeah. You press the button and the sheep pops up and the water disappears and then whichever direction the sheep walks in you know you're supposed to come green sheep they win and that person gets to go gather up all the different things it's a really simple game so simple we decided to have another try another guy? yeah got a potion, come on sheepy come to green come to green green, 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 come on come on sheepy come on Come on! Oh, oh, come on! Keep coming! Come on, sheepy! Come on! Don't just stand there! Just a few more steps! Come on! Come on, sheepy! Come on, sheepy, sheep, sheep! Yes! Come on, sheepy! I win! See, I can. I mean, it's not an extra life, but I've won something. What did I win? Golden apple. Golden apple. Fence posts. <laughs> okay. So, yeah, I'm doing pretty well. I quite like this game now. Where's he gonna go now? Where's he gonna go? Come on. Come on. Come on, another couple of steps. Come on. Come on. You can do it! Yay! I will again! Well, golden apples for me and golden apples and... That was pretty good. So you can see, I had a pretty good day. I've met up with some cool people and I've given away some gifts and I've checked out some interesting things and I've, I'm pretty happy with today. I think this is how I should go. From now on, I mean I need to get an extra life back because I'm only on two, but other than that I'm having a good day. So thanks for watching. Leave a comment, like, subscribe, tell your friends and I'll see you next time where I'll try and get back another life because two is just not enough. Bye for now.